be committed to your word, be committed to your project, be committed to your client, your customer, whatever it is, your product, your service, you should be committed to it. And you're willing to go the extra mile to help people reach their goal. When you are doing business or you are working out a job, it does not matter. There's going to come a time where something is difficult, something is standing in your way, something is preventing you from ultimately going where you want to go or having what you want to have. In those moments, you need to have a positive attitude mentally because you, if you do not, you're going to miss out on opportunities. And here's what I mean by that is that if you don't, you need to interpret this situation as a challenge. Okay. This is a challenge to me. You know, um, I wonder what other services or products or whatever I can create because I'm experiencing this challenge. This challenge is going to serve me not only now, it will bring me, you know, a, a return on uh, this experience. So whatever I'm experiencing right now, I need to pay attention because I want to, uh, I want to get the information so that I can provide an even better service, even another layer to my, uh, to my business. I want to provide even something more. I want to up my skill set, right? Because remember, you are the most valuable part of this equation. If you are valuable, you will always be able to increase your income to the point where you dictate your income. I will only work. I will only participate if I am paid this much. Less focus on I, less focus on I, more focus on you, okay? Your clients, your customers, their goals need to be at the center of whatever business it is that you are doing. doesn't matter if you own it or you're working for a company. You are doing business when you go to work. When you are earning an income, you are doing business. So you need to think about your clients and their needs at the center of it all. Okay. Anything that is like, oh, I need to get paid. So I just need to do this so that they can pay me money. That's very you focused. This person has a need. This person has something. Of course, they want to pay you for your service, your time, your whatever it is. But you need to be focused. How do I help them help their fix their goal? They have a need. You have a solution. But the 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 focus of this whole thing doesn't need to be on. Uh, but you have a problem. If you have a problem of I need the money. I I just need to get this job. I need more experience. Somebody should hire me for this price so that I can then, you know, go out and get more jobs. That's a you problem. You're in business to solve somebody else's problem. So you need to keep the focus where it needs to go. This also helps you create a definiteness of purpose in yourself. Meaning if you come to work every day, how can I solve somebody's problem today? How am I helping somebody else reach their goal? How am I helping somebody else eliminate a problem or a struggle that they have had, maybe even for a long period of time. How can I help that person do that? That creates that um, focus, that drive, that definiteness. Nope, this is what I'm doing when I show up to work. And it keeps you from drifting back into the, well, I need money or I need to pay this bill or I need more work or I want you know to be paid more. All of that is a you problem. None of that is about this, how this whole thing started, how you even got this business idea or this position that you're working at in the first place. So remember, you cannot skip steps, but whatever you are doing right now is, is a, I'm sorry, whatever you are earning right now is a reflection of your past behavior when it comes to determining, Hey, I will be paid this much money. Remember that Whatever you have done in the past has led you onto this point, And that is what you are worth according to yourself. Because you have told the spirit world, I'm willing to cut corners. I'm willing to not do sacrificing. I'm willing to uh, not work up to my potential. I'm not going to do excellence. I'm not going to go above and beyond. I'm not going to be a person of my word. 